Hello and welcome to Doncaster English Language School. In today's lesson, we're going to be looking at auxiliary verbs. Question number one, what's an auxiliary verb? With the present simple, we usually use do and does. We usually use these words with questions, sometimes with positive sentences. We also have don't and doesn't. These are always used in negative sentences. Don't is do not, doesn't is does not. But when we speak, we usually say don't and doesn't. Using the past simple, we always use the words did and didn't. Did is used in questions and sometimes positive sentences. Didn't is always used in negative sentences. Didn't is the same as did not. But when we speak, we usually say didn't. Question number two, why do we use auxiliary verbs? Two reasons. The first one, if we have a question or we have a negative sentence, then we use an auxiliary verb. Reason number two is if we have an important verb like live, speak, watch, listen, talk, then we have an auxiliary verb. Now, how do you know if it's an important verb? It's easy. If you cover the main verb, the important verb, and you say the question, where do you? No meaning. But if you cover the auxiliary verb and you look at the question, where you live, you still understand. This is not important. This is important. Live. No. These words give you meaning. An important tip just to help you with the word order with questions, try and remember quasi. Q U for question word, A for auxiliary verb, S for subject, you, he, she, we, you, they, it, and I for verb infinitive. When you use the question with an auxiliary verb, when you use the negative with the auxiliary verb, don't have S here, don't have ED here, don't have ING here, just the verb infinitive. Now there are two things you need to think about when using auxiliary verbs in questions. The first one is sentence stress. Where do you live? Where do you live? Where did you live? Where did you live? It's difficult to hear this, okay? And we have what we call the schwa. That's uh, uh, uh. Here, it's easy to hear these words because they're important words. Where do you live? Where did you live? Okay. With this one, it's similar, sentence stress, important. Uh, but here, we have a linking sound. Where does she live? Where does she live? And here, where does he live? Where does he live? Does she? Does he? Does she? Does he? A little difference. So next time you're speaking English, think carefully before you say this. It should be, I don't understand. And here, how do you spell it? Look at all the different sentences that you can use with auxiliary verbs. There are so, so many, and they're very easy to practice. Thank you for watching.